Okay, this is our next uh, building project. We're going to uh, show you how to go ahead and or how to go about building this. We uh, show you how it works here. We this all you, you know it's like hanging on the wall. That's just that's how it's presented, and you wind it up. It takes a, a minute, and it wants to go on its own, but a lot of times you might have to give it a little swing. Um, this is about six foot off the floor and uh, it'll run like this for about 15, 20 minutes. And that's uh, pretty good entertainment for just a few seconds of work. And to go over the equipment that we're going to need to build this. And in the back there you'll see a scroll saw. And in front here and on the right is a drill press. Those are the two major pieces. I wanted to take you through the drawings here so you can see what uh, you're going to get if you buy the drawings from me on my website. Uh, the title or the uh, Address is in the description just below the video if you want to buy it and then uh, just type that in and and it'll take you to a website where you can purchase the, the drawing. You get uh, nine eight and a half by eleven sheets, two of these make up the uh, assembly drawing and there's the materials, uh, the names of the pieces, and this is the assembly uh, one, two, three steps to go through. And this is the second part of the assembly. This is the material list, just tells you what kind of wood and what pieces will go on that kind of wood or thickness. Uh, this is the actual patterns that you will cut out and lay on the, the wood to be uh, cut out, the wood. They're laid on there with a spray adhesive uh, that you spray on the back of the paper and, and the wood and then lay those on there. There's another pattern piece. This is... Uh, the frame and it's too big to be put on uh, one sheet. So we and the reason you cut these little notches here is so you can see beyond and see the, where the line is on the other piece. So right there is a pretty good match. And so when you get it, all the lines kind of lined up, you can tape it.
of, of cutting outside of the line and leaving the line. And we have a, uh, a sander thing that will hook up to our scroll saw and use this to sand down uh, the areas that we need to sand. I wanted to say one more thing about the scroll saw here is um, the work that's been done so far, uh, those cuts have been done with this blade here and a little longer blade. It, it uh, seems to saw a little more evenly when you're trying to do kind of a slight bend. Uh, these sharp corners that are going to be done next, I'll come down through here with this little tiny blade, then saw the bottom off right there, and then I'll come up here and saw this top, and I'll just alternate back and forth and go around the around the gear. So for all these holes that the shafts are going to go in, we want we need to get them as close as possible uh, to the drawings. And so what I do is I put a a pinhole right in the center of that X, and then I use a brad point drill bit uh, to get that hole started. set up these shaft spacing to match the holes that we're going to drill on the on the frame and I want to just check these gears and see if they're going to run fairly smooth so put it together like that the real test is to run it slow and this is it's got a couple places we might have to sand a little bit by hand but These uh, both have hubs uh, to them, and if you can see this little mark, that's where I start the the gears every time, so they stay in the same same place when they're going around the. When this one's going around the big gear, that has one little spacer on top. These two spacers go on, then this the spool. This is the shaft that goes in there. We have two spacers that go on that. This hub is glued to the six wheel. And so we, this is uh, stationary, it's glued in there, so these items I'm putting on here now, the shaft doesn't turn, but these turn around the shaft, so, and you've got to have those spacers in there, or it won't uh, it'll rub. Okay.
in this episode. And this little link goes in there. And I believe we're ready to give her a try. That's basically how it runs. That should do it. Thank you.